Hi, I'm Dr. Terry Clancy, Somerset County's Director of Public Health and Safety. Somerset County has experienced four major storm and flooding events in the past 25 years. Hurricane Floyd, Hurricane Irene, Superstorm Sandy, and most recently, Hurricane Ida. These storms have been increasing in intensity over the decades, and the predictions are that we will see more in the future, possibly even this year. When a disaster strikes, Somerset County is ready to support each of its municipalities and residents. When we are not responding to a disaster, the county's Office of Emergency Management works every day ensuring Somerset County is prepared to respond to the next event. This department helps plan response strategies and organize teams ready to activate on a moment's notice and coordinates responses during the disasters themselves. These include the Community Emergency Response Team's volunteers, public works personnel, sheriff's officers, community animal response teams, and so many others that stand ready at all times to assist the municipalities with evacuations, clearing roads and bridges, and protect property and lives. Following a disaster, the county continues to work with its partners, including nonprofits and government relief programs, such as the American Red Cross, the New Jersey Office of Emergency Management, and the Federal Emergency Management Agency to ensure people have the food, shelter, and cleaning supplies they need. We all work together to reduce the impact of disasters while they're happening and to speed the recovery as much as possible afterward. But as much as your town, county, state, and nonprofits can do together, you can also prepare before disasters so that your family is better protected and ready to respond whenever they occur. I'd like to introduce Lisa Werner, Somerset County's Emergency Management Director, who will discuss how you can prepare your home and family for a potential disaster. Thank you, Dr. Clancy. As the Director and Coordinator of Emergency Management for Somerset County, I can tell you that each disaster presents its own set of challenges. But the sole purpose of this office is to ensure that everyone is prepared and ready to assist our municipalities and residents. We start by ensuring that we have the resources and personnel needed to support local responses. As you can see, we have dedicated equipment for CERT, which includes cots and blankets and other items that may be needed for emergency evacuations. We also have a dedicated team, CART, to ensure all of your animals are cared for and safe. In an emergency, this facility activates as the county's emergency operations center and central hub for the coordination of all of the county's response efforts. You can be better prepared for any emergency by doing three things. Make a plan, create an emergency kit, and stay informed. Make a plan for your household, including any pets, so that you and your family know what to do, where to go, and what you will need to protect yourselves in any disaster. Your plan should include evacuation routes to safety that are not likely to flood, at least one location outside the home where everyone can meet if communications are down, a contact, preferably out of state, everyone can check in with if you get separated, a list of any prescriptions your family needs and how to get those refills, as well as contact information for your medical providers, and of course, Emergency information sources such as radio stations, websites, or government social media accounts. Your emergency kit will vary according to each family, but what you should include is an emergency first aid kit, water, non-perishable foods, anything that you can think of, a rain poncho in case needed, a mask if needed, flashlights, batteries, radio, and don't forget your pets. And in addition, go to the Somerset County website, soconj.gov backslash alerts. You can also sign up for Smart 911 to help first responders know what to expect when they respond to your residence. If we all prepare ahead of time, we can minimize the impact of any disaster, from a kitchen fire to a regional flood.